Welcome to the Spatial Data Repository, which provides geographically linked health and demographic data from the Demographic and Health Surveys Program, or DHS for short, and the U.S. Census Bureau. The Spatial Data Repository has several features. The Survey Boundaries page allows you to visualize the change in subnational DHS survey regions over time. The Indicator Download page allows you to download customized packages of DHS indicators population estimates for use in a geographic information system, also known as GIS. The Spatial Data Repository offers modeled surface data, providing a standard set of spatially modeled map surfaces for recent population-based surveys. The Geospatial Covariates page provides data, linking the DHS program survey GPS locations to external geospatial covariate datasets including population, climate, and environmental variables. The Population Estimates page provides data from the U.S. Census Bureau subnational five-year age or sex grouped population estimates and projections for 2000 to 2020 for designated countries in the President's Emergency Plan. Let's start with the Boundaries page and choose Tanzania from the Country dropdown. The Boundaries page allows you to view and download the subnational regions for DHS program surveys. The main table summarizes the survey for the chosen country, starting with the most recent. To learn more about viewing and comparing DHS survey boundaries, view the Boundaries video tutorial on the Resources page. We will now close the map window and click on the Data page, which allows you to build custom GIS data packages. You have three options when downloading data. The single country option will allow you to choose specific surveys from one country. This option will also allow you to download U.S. Census Bureau subnational estimates and projections and detailed HIV packages containing survey-specific indicators that aren't available in the standard database. The Many Countries option will allow you to download indicator data for the most recent surveys for multiple countries. The All Countries option will allow you to quickly download the most common indicators for the most recent surveys for all available countries. To learn more about downloading data, view the Downloading SDR Data video tutorial on the Resources page. The Methodology page contains background information about each of the pages within the Spatial Data Repository, including information on survey boundaries and indicator data, modeled surfaces, geospatial covariates, and population estimates. Click on the Data Structure arrow to view additional information about which files are included in each DHS program and U.S. Census Bureau download package. Click on the Subnational Boundaries arrow to view information about the boundary sources for each dataset. The Resources page contains links to video tutorials, DHS program data resources, software resources, and data sources that are helpful when making maps or conducting spatial analysis. The ESRI training curriculum is available for download for users interested in learning how to use ESRI and DHS indicator data. The curriculum contains all the necessary materials for anyone with basic computer skills to learn how to open, join, display, query, and export data in ESRI. The gallery page showcases health and HIV-related maps that are available in a variety of print and web formats. The gallery provides three different modes to browse, filter, or search maps. The icon on the top left of the page indicates the viewing mode. The default mode is the grid view, which displays the map title and thumbnail image. The list mode allows you to read summary information about each map before viewing it. The map mode geographically displays the countries that have map products available. All of the viewing modes allow you to filter by topic and or country. Selecting gender and Bangladesh, for example, will display only products that map gender issues in Bangladesh. The clear selection button will remove all filters. You may also search by country or keyword. Searching for ITN will display only products that display ITN usage or ownership. 
If you have a health-related map that you would like to be featured in the Spatial Data Repository Gallery, send it to spatialdata at dhsprogram.com. Please explore the website and give us feedback at spatialdata at dhsprogram.com.